Hello there viewers, welcome back to another episode of Crusader Yeah, Crusader Kings 3. I can't speak. Um, welcome back. Last time, we won the biggest war ever, basically. I'm calling it right now. That was the biggest war in the history of wars. It might not be, but I'm saying it is. Um, and we took a huge amount of land off these guys here, who are now just a shell of their former selves. Um, which puts us in a really great position. We're now the biggest sort of single state in what would be Hispania. We got a load of troops. Got a solid alliance with England as well. So we're in a really good position. Um, because I won that war, I wholly warred it, and I won it, which means that I now have a load of new uh, titles that I have, which puts me massively over my domain limit. So I'm going to just sort them out a bit today it can be a bit of an administrative start to the day um what have we got here i've got a perk i've got a lifestyle perk that i can do um yeah let's do that foreign affairs we're going down the diplomat sort of route um short of truces and no prestige penalty for breaking them that's good uh what's that fabricate claim speed is quicker yeah that's good and then diplomat we will gain which will be uh, plus diplomacy. So, yeah, we'll do that. We're just going to go down this middle tree. Foreign affairs. Let's do that. And uh, then we're almost at another diplomacy point as well because I sort of forgot that we had one. Uh, 18 diplomacy. What a guy. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to sort out some of these titles now. I think I might have a couple of... No, they're all counties. That's good. I thought I'd have a few madams, but I don't think I have. Um, I've not got enough money to create a duchy, but... What's the duchy? That's the duchy there. So that's a big old duchy. He's actually got it still. Can I usurp it? Because I should be able to. Surely I should be able to usurp it. Yeah. Uh, 250 squid. It'll cost me. But I'll get some prestige. Okay. Well, I'll have to do that eventually. But for now, I'm just going to have to give away some titles. Um, which is... I'm just going to give them to like random people. Like the people that it recommends sort of thing. Because I don't really know who to give them to. Like, you can have that one. I'm going to try and give them to separate people, though. Because I don't want to have one vassal that's just too strong. Always keep your vass vassals weak. Um, so you've got that one. Oh, you've got claims. Okay. Did I just give you a title? I feel like I've just given this guy a title. I'll give it to Alonzo. Because I like his name. Um... I'm sure I just gave you... No, I've given that hairy, homeless-looking man one. Okay. Um, Toledo. Well, we'll give that to you now. Because you're of noble birth. Toledo. And then Madrid. We can give to Vela. And then... What have we got here? Another one. Which we shall give... No, I didn't want to click on me. I wanted to click on that and then that. Give to this guy who would make a really good spy master. And then what else do we have? We've got six. So is there another one that we got? Yeah, we got that one. Um, so I'll just give that to another person. You're my guest. I don't really want to give it to a guest. Um, you, you look quite good in terms of stats. I'll give it to you. There we go. Excellent. So now we're back to the level of domain that we need to have, which is good. Got that little battle thing as well. Um, so what I need to do now really is just save up to usurp this title because at the moment he's got a title that I should have. So I'm going to wait until I can do that. He doesn't like me. He's not all that fond of me, to be honest with you, which is fair. I don't think I've got... Oh yeah, I've got a truce with him. Which is also fair. Um, but Navarra. I don't think I've got a truce with Navarra now. I think I've got claims on Navarra. So I could just, you know, do a cheeky claim there. What's that? Is that like a ducal claim? That's well expensive. I could literally inherit Navarra here. Which would be great. I should probably wait a little bit though. Until my troops are looking a bit stronger. But then again, you've only got 460 troops at the moment. You've got claims on some stuff. Hmm. You've got an alliance with 
our so yeah, I, I probably don't need to wait. I think I'm gonna sneeze. No, I'm not gonna sneeze. That would have been pretty funny if I'd have sneezed, but I've sort of, you know, when you can swallow the sneeze back and then you don't sneeze. I did that. Uh, my cousin Queen Urika, I thought I killed you. I thought you were my aunt and I killed you. Was that a different Urika? They all have the same name. My cousin Queen, I'm going, where are you Queen of? Oh, Navara. Oh, okay, you're not going to like me if I wore you then. Um, has been showing the signs of pregnancy for some time now, and everyone thought her husband, King Rodrigo, was the father of the child. Now it has become clear that the real father-to-be is none other than Clodari. Oh my, what a scandal. Well, I'm not going to lie, love. If you're going around doing stuff like that, you really don't deserve to be in charge of this little strip of land, do you? So I might just have to, based off that and that alone... You're a sinner as well. So no one would really blame me for, you know, going to war and attacking you. So I think I'm going to have to, aren't I? How are we looking for strength? 3,100 versus 500 plus 700, so 1,200. I can do it. I've got a strong army. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. Let's have a cheeky war, shall we? While I've got the claims. 108 prestige, it's going to cost me. Why wouldn't you? 108 prestige is an absolute bargain. Move the rally point to there. I'm finally getting a hold of these rally points now and I sort of know how to use them maybe a little bit now. Let's do it. I've got loads of money so I'm not really worried about going into debt. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Come on. I'm trying to chase you down. There we go. I got you. I got you. I just love the music. It's just so good. It's very loud though. I've had to turn it down quite a significant amount so you can hear my mic over it. Because it is loud. I will say that. They've not they've not cheaped out on the volume of the music. We've gone to town with the volume. Uh, I'm going to win this. Why are, you, why are you coming here? Why are you trying to get involved with me? I'm going to win. It's going to be fantastic. And now you've got no troops. It's great. There you go. Look at you. Silly boys. Silly, silly boys. Oh, have I got number 19? He's only 19. I had someone who was like 25. What's going on? Not that it matters. Got a new perk I can unlock as well. Let's go over here. Let's do that. And then I can unlock my perk. What's this? Shorter truces, no prestige. Cool. I'll take that. I like that. That's a good one. 47% already, which is great. Uh, they're coming for more. They want more war. They just love it, these guys do, don't they? They love a fight. Absolutely love it. Okay, have a fight with me. That's fine. Dangerous faction. What's that? Military power. Uh, oh, wants independence. Oh, okay, it's just some peasants. Okay, cool. Well, I'll win this war and then I'll kick your asses. So that'll be fine. Oh, cool. A knight killed someone. That's good. Well done. Uh, that's good. And now we should be just sieging here, which I think we are. It's always a really awkward place to click. Seven months? What? Why is that going to take seven months? I've got my own nagers. Onagas. Onagas. There, look. See? I might look at starting to increase the size of these now because I can't create a new men at arms regiment. So I might just increase the size. I don't really know what that does. I assume it gives you more troops that are specialised in them areas. Um, I assume. I'm assuming there. So I might, I might try that at some point. Seven months. I'm going to knock this up a speed. Um, because that seven months is going to take ages otherwise. And then we'll have an even bigger, an even bigger Leon. I wonder how close we will be to creating the Empire of Hispania then. That is, of course, the the aim of this, to be the first Emperor of Hispania. I don't know if it will be the first Emperor. I assume that there's been no other... Oh, that's good. We're almost done. I assume there's been no other Emperor of Espana, but I'm not too good on my Spanish history, so I couldn't really tell you. 
That was a nice quick war, wasn't it? Enforce demands. That's my stuff now. Cool. Look at that. Excellent. That looks great. Is she still in charge though? Yeah, and now she hates me. It's a bit of an issue. Disband them. Can I revoke your title for being, you know, you? Or I could revoke your title. I've got claims. She won't accept though. That'll result in another war. Is that better than having someone hate me though? She controls one, two. He hates me as well. Can I revoke your title? Um, yeah, I could revoke. I could just go around revoking titles and then giving them to people that like me. I probably should do that, shouldn't I? Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Um, which one do I want, Navara or Delido? We're going Navara. Oh, but then again, she's got another title, and if it only lets me revoke one of them, then that'll just she'll just hate me forever. But she'll be really weak, I suppose. She has got claims as well. I kind of don't want her to have claims. Okay, well I'll, I'm going to do that. Uh, you're going to rebel, which is going to be fine because I'm just going to go and smash you. Then yeah, that's fine. Raise the troops. And then we'll just come up here and kick your butts. And then we'll have your title. And that'll be great. Well, I think what'll happen is we'll imprison you first, won't we? And then we'll revoke your title. Let's go this way. Let's see what's going to happen. I'm going to win this decisively, apparently, which is great. Are we going to get there in time before you nip off? Yeah, I think we are. That's good. Okay, cool. Uh, what's happened there? Have I lost a battle? Who's fighting? Oh, you called these guys back in. I've got troops there. Um, okay. Didn't know you guys were there. Oh, I've pressed C again. That's a really useful shortcut, but I keep accidentally pressing it. Which means it's not so useful. Oh, that was easy. Captured her. Cool. Okay. Um, enforced demands. <laughs> oh, that was really easy. Sorry, she, she's having such a rough time of it at the moment, but I am sorry. Um, so, yeah, I've just got you now. So now I can just force you to give me your titles. Can I do that one as well? Can I revoke two, or is that going to be tyranny? No, that's going to be fine. Okay, cool. Sweet, you've got no titles now. That's cool. Can I execute you as well? Can I kill you? I could kill you as well. She's my cousin and my rival. Um, people probably wouldn't like it. Like, but Oh, you're my vassal as well. But then again, you're the guy that I was going to do. Yeah, let's kill her. Why not? Yeah, why not? We'll kill her. Uh, and then I was going to get this guy as well, wasn't I? Revoke that title. Let's do that. You've got like... Yeah, rally the trip. Ooh. How are you getting involved? Okay. Why are you getting involved? I didn't realise that you'd get involved. Um, cool. Let's raise... Where's the... Raise all. There we go. Raise all. It's just a bit of admin, this. is just a light bit of admin. And war as well. So we've still got a numbers advantage on these guys. I didn't realise these guys were going to get involved, but they are, so, you know, whatever. It is what it is at the end of the day. Where are you going? Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop being annoying. There. Okay. There. We'll fight you. Um, these are slot 51 guys. These can just go. Can I just disband them? How do you disband them? Just stop. Disband. No? Okay, cool. Will you come up here, and then I'll meet you there. I'll meet you there, mate. All right. And then we'll go up here, and we'll... What's happened there? What's happening? I've got a... Yeah, I know I'm above domain limit. Uh, unite the Spanish thrones. Okay. What's this, then? Uh, the Spanish thrones will be united once more, and this time under the banner of Leon. Every Spanish kingdom title that you own, except your primary title will be destroyed and their territories will become de jour part of that's good 
I like that. I'm going to do that because then I'll have a bigger du jour kingdom. Um, that's really good. I'm going to really do that in a minute. I'm going to finish this war first. And then I'm definitely going to do that because that will mean that my du jour kingdom will go, if I can visually show you, from being this little sliver here to being this here but if i can take if i can get the kingdom of navarra as well and that will become part of it and all this will become du jour part of um leon is there a kingdom of navarra who has the kingdom of navarra does that exist does it do i have it i've got it oh cool so that all that's really good then so all of the if i understand that correctly all of the kingdom titles what's the best one to show you there you go all of the kingdom titles that i have which is navarra castile leon and Ca Ca uh, galassia the galassia castile and navarra will be destroyed and they'll all just become leon which will be sick that'll be ace that'll be so cool we'll have a massive party to celebrate and everything that'll be great um how long is this going to take to siege five months well it's okay because i've got my emergency 70 troops coming so that'll you know kick us into overdrive drive i think uh these guys are over here just doing stuff i thought this guy liked me who is it it's him isn't it or is it is it him it's him you like me why are you getting involved man we were friends and now you're just being an idiot and you know getting involved in things that don't concern you i just don't understand why you do that uh, create cadet, cadet branch. I might do that as well. I need to finish these wars first, and then we can look at doing that. Um, so let's just get this all sorted. This is a right good administrative episode, isn't it? Merge the armies. Let's finish this siege. Hopefully, we get capture some good prisoners here. Oh, hang on a sec. Sorry, I was having a go at these people for being part of that, but actually, it's that. Sorry, I get confused very easily. Where are you going? You're going for my capital. Okay, I think it's going to take you quite a while to siege my capital down. Let's have a look and see. I'm interested. Six months. Okay, so we've got enough time to finish this siege over here. I think. To the brash King Fernando will not stand your vile oppression of good Andalusian Mudwalis any longer. Time is at hand. Uh, with Alagai and us will rise up free. Um okay what what do you want the andalusian oh you're just a peasant you're just a peasant go away peasant ha peasants how many are there oh there's quite a lot of peasants oh okay that could be an issue um yeah actually thinking about it why am i so dumb why am i not I want you to be increasing the counting control like down here where it's all kicking off yeah let's do that go here and just make everyone love me a little bit more i forget that i can do stuff sometimes um this is taking ages here i need to go and really sort this out don't i i imagine they're quite a weak army because they're just you know a weak army um hopefully this will 100 percent me once i've scored uh siege this down and then i can go and deal with the the uprising hopefully fingers crossed to get a good prisoner or something 44 percent. okay that's not done what i was hoping um right what do we want to do i should probably go and do this this first because if my capital gets what why would you do that my capital gets sieged down, then that's not a good day at the office. Oh my god, select them. Thank you. Uh, let's go over here. Let's do that. And we'll pick up some troops on the way, I think. Um, and then we can go and deal with Madrid. Hopefully Madrid doesn't prove to be a thorn in the side. Potential battle in 40 days. Okay, that's good. We're gaining some troops while we're going over there as well they just made a lot of progress on the siege but i think we'll get there in time yeah they're running away you're running away aren't you of course you are i think oh lovely okay uh his hooks expired on me that's good i didn't know you had one. Oh, that's you godfroy i don't like you what we're we on 78 
percent okay well we'll leave that there for now and then we really do need to go and deal with these guys so we're gonna have to go and deal with these guys i think yeah i think that's probably the best thing to do i imagine we'll win this battle they've got more troops but okay well they've sieged somewhere that's not good okay go here go where are you going you're going here okay um yeah, I imagine we're going to win this. What's this dangerous faction? You want lower... Are you just a... You're just another peasant uprising? Great, okay, cool. Um, that's the thing with this game. When you're at war, the wars just don't stop. You start a war and another war starts and another war starts and you just end up with in like a cycle of wars. So you've got to step on them pretty quickly in order to stop them. Um which I'm hoping that I can do with this. What are we? Chances are even. Really? Really? How about with this guy in charge? The chances still even? We'll probably lose. How are we going to probably lose? Are they in a mountain or something? What's going on? How, how are we actually probably going to lose that? That's ridiculous. We're like an actual army and they're just 300 guys with pitchforks. Trappings of majesty are stand above my subjects as sovereign ruler, unequaled in the realm, dressing the part. I already dressed the part. Look at him. He looks fantastic. What are you talking about? Uh, um, well, I'm not going to spend 115 quid. Uh, I'm probably not going to do that because that's only 46%. So I'm just going to take the party and go away. I don't understand. How, how are we probably going to lose this? What? Three? Who's in charge here? Who's in charge of this uprising? Who are you? Why? Why? Is why am I possibly going to lose this then? I'd really like that to be explained to me. Well supplied, but we're probably going to lose. I don't get it. I don't. I don't. Okay. Well, we're just we're committed now, so. We're just going to have to wait and see, aren't we? Can I get away before they come here, maybe? I can't understand how we're going to lose this. We're not going to lose it. Well, why did it say we were probably going to lose it then? Gave me a heart attack then, man. Of course we were never going to lose it. Why did it say we were going to lose it when we were obviously never going to lose it? That really threw me. I got really concerned very quickly then. Okay, yeah, you are you can be... I'm, I might execute you. Can I execute him? Are we going to get any penalties? No. Burn him at the stake. See you later, boy. Got to stamp these things out. Okay, you're back in Leon now, so let's go back to Leon. And let's kick your asses. What are we on? 83%. Is that just going up as well? I think that's just going up, yeah. Yeah, it is 18%. So, we should do this before there's any sort of issue of them decisioning this. And then we can unite the kingdoms. Oh my god, I'm so excited. That's going to be so cool. Oh god, sorry, I'm stretching. Oh, sorry, that was a really good stretch. I could have edited that out, but I chose not to. Because sometimes... You, you all know what it's like to have a good stretch. God, that felt good. To the obnoxious King Fernando, we've been... But what are you? Get out of here, peasants. No, go away. More peasants kicking off at me. This is ridiculous. I'm going to get involved. Winner takes me on. That's the that's the rule. Winner takes on Fernando. Actually, he's doing me a favour because he's weakening the peasants for me. So thank you. Yeah, winner takes Fernando. Come on. Let's have you. Let's be having you. There you go. Have some of that, peasants. I'm probably going to kill you now as well because you've annoyed me by revolting. Can I execute you? I'm going to spend some piety, but... Uh, allowing you to execute him without being viewed as silent. Yeah, man. Why not? He annoyed me. Go away. You awful person. Uh, right, so I think we just need to sit this one out now because we're like winning massively the war all this for a little patch of land over there that no one cares about um that's going to tick up slowly slowly catchy monkey i think 
and then we win. Either that, or I can just go and maybe desiege the capital over here. That might be fun. Uh, this is a really long episode. I'm going to stick with it though, because I want to finish this war and then I want to unite the kingdoms, and then we'll end. That's like the plan. So we'll stick with it. Thank you for sticking with it if you've got to this point and not given up, um, because I've frustrated you somehow. I can understand why you'd do that. I frustrate myself sometimes, especially accidentally clicking buttons that I don't mean to click. But, you know, stuff happens sometimes. Uh, what are we on? Let's see how long this is going to take now. Come on. Seven months. Man, these sieges take so long. Let's go up to five. The map, my spies have informed me about a hunter causing a ruckus at a local tavern. Um, oh yeah, we've seen this before. Uh, we'll just do that. That'll be fine. Excellent. 100%. Cool. Enforce demands. Yes. I win. I revoke your title. And now you go away. Cool. Right, okay, that's finally done that for that little piece of land. I need to give away these pieces of land now. So what is it? That one? I need to give away. Grant to... Um, yeah, man, you can have it. You 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 don't look 18, I'm not going to lie to you. Are you sure you're 18? Is that fake ID that you're showing me? You can have it, why not? Uh, where else do I need to give away? Navara. We'll give to... Um, this guy he's pretty old but he can have it and then where else that place there we will give to you and now ladies and gentlemen we should be able to finally i've got four thrones here that i should be able to unite into one um i'm, I'm excited about this unite the spanish thrones Let's do it. A united Spain. Once more, the thrones of Spain have been united under one king. The false monarchs have been drowned, uh, sorry, decrowned, while proud Leon stands stronger than ever. One day, I shall pass from this world and go to heaven, yet my legacy will remain on earth forever. They will call me King Fernando, the father of Spain. Wow. Fernando's the absolute best best he's such a beast what a guy i'm now known as the father of spain look at this king fernando the second the father of spain and look at that that looks so cool that looks so snazzy and then leon is just du jour all of that now oh god that's exciting look at that that looks so cool i'm well excited about that and on that note the father of spain shall retire for this episode uh thank you very much for watching i really enjoyed that i hope you did too um if you've liked it then hit a like on it if you want to subscribe for more hit subscribe uh thank you for all of the support and i will see you next time goodbye <laughs>